Welcome to Direct Academy, I'm Cyclohexanol. Today we're going to be talking about heating our modules and the effects of an online, offline, or missing module in the slot and its effect on the heat. For our testing we're going to use a coercer with dual light beam laser 2s and a couple of burst aerators to make them fire a little bit faster, as we can see here in Pypha. On the screen we show all five sets of modules for our test runs, as well as a table that we compiled the data from the test runs with, and on that table you'll also have the average value of the time that it took to burn the modules out. In this first test we have the modules that aren't being heated online instead of offline. We aren't cycling them here, but in a later test we did cycle those modules. We won't include that one, but we found that it was still around that 1 minute 29 seconds average, so it doesn't really have much of a difference, if any at all. It's important to note that we did speed up the video clips here for the testing. For the sake of time, if you want to go ahead and check my work, you can go do so by going back and counting the cycles, and it'll give you about the same results. In this test we have offline modules in the high slots instead of online modules. And here from the, the table we can actually see that we get a fair amount more heat out of our guns. That's a little more than a minute heat extra that we can get out of our guns by having those offline modules up there. Now you wouldn't generally have a bunch of offline modules like that in your high rack on a destroyer or something like that. But it does go to show us that the offline modules do soak heat better than the online modules. We're not showing the testing here, but we did do a test where the module slots are empty that were previously just being used as heat sinks. And we can see from this graph that offline modules will actually help to sink just about the same amount of heat as the empty module slots, which is interesting. So just a few notes to close out here. Uh, offline and missing module slots will allow you to heat uh, longer without burning out your gun, so you'll take less heat damage in the slot that that's happening in. Next you have the same heat soak for offline and missing modules. The difference that we had in testing was negligible. And lastly, uh, your online modules will soak the same heat when they're cycling as when they're not cycling. So what is this knowledge actually good for? I'd have to say that the main application here is when determining what you want in your utility high slots. I wouldn't recommend really turning off guns to help heat in the rest of the rack as that would probably cost you more DPS than it would save uh, from the heat. But if you have, say, an empty high slot, a lot of people might go and say fill that with a salvager or a festival launcher. But if you really want to conserve heat, just leave the slot empty or put an offline module there. Thanks for watching and don't forget to fly dangerously.